Okay, so I need to head up there. Can I get like how to navigate there? Okay, I am navigating. Hmm. It doesn't seem like an like I can go through here. Ah, okay, now I see a bit more of the map and I'm able to see how I'm supposed to go up here. The giant ore vein, the one they discovered. That must be where the clashes are centered. Come on, let's get to higher ground. Ah, and Let's hope he's asleep and not dead. Mm. Holy crap, my Rocha just did 10k in damage with his ult. But isn't he supposed to be a healer? <laughs> Impressive. Hey, wakey wakey! You'll get mushrooms growing on your head. Okay. Hmm? I don't think that's what? something that happens. Mushroom bed. I can't see it on the menu. Huh? My Sila! His heal skills open his attack. Oh, okay. How can you sleep here? Get back to safety and take shelter. Take shelter? I remember now. These guys came out of nowhere and got into a fight with the mining team. At the time I was exhausted. I'd hardly run a few feet when one of them caught me. If it weren't for wildfire, they'd have stolen the clothes off my back. Take your clothes? These ones? You don't know these guys. <laughs> no moral compass. They'd rob you blind in a flash. The, the, the way we just roasted his clothes. The great mine hasn't fallen under their control completely. Uh, speaking of which, where is Wildfire? Did they head further in? Is there a fight happening? It seems like Chief Oleg must be up ahead. Hurry up and get back to safety. Look for Nat. I'm trying not to get into another scrap along the way. Okay. Thank you for um. I'm trying not to lose your clothes. If I get back soon enough, I'll have time for a. Oh no. Okay. I recognize that woman. That's Elaine from First Mining Team. Quick. Elaine, are you okay? Are you hurt? Uh, Zila, thank goodness. I I'm fine. Just a couple of sprains. Couple of sprains. Yeah, yeah, that's you totally fine. Timing. Those vagrants were asking me about the robots, but I don't know anything. Robots? Oh, don't you know? The intersection of the Great Mine has been seized by a band of robots. Neither the mining team nor the vagrants can get anywhere near. New challengers enter. About time. Human only conflicts are so boring. Does anyone know where the robots come from? What is that in the background? At first, we thought that a collective fault had occurred in the excavation machines, but then we found out that those machines didn't even belong to the mining team. They came out of nowhere and pushed the vagrants and us back. Then they blocked off the only tunnels into the intersection. Maybe someone's playing tricks. Can we just <laughs> There's no way anyone in the mining them? team is behind this. Operating a single unit is tiring enough, but a whole group? <laughs> Impossible. Then there's only one possibility. Looks like that challenge chest. Okay. Sparog. Sparog? That name sounds familiar. So like defeat an enemy and get a chest? You remember the robots we defeated in the boxing gym? Just say he's not to be trifled with. Let's Don't worry, we the... can beat him up. Elaine, can you make it back to safety? No problem. Zila and the rest of you, be careful. Careful? That's my middle name. Robots aligned against humans? Or we can pretend. I've never heard of such a thing. Machines should obey humans unconditionally. Is this elevator Kay. broken? <laughs> Why isn't it responding? 
10 out of 10 voice acting there. Why are you worried about this piece of junk? Do you really want to go down there and be a live target for the robots? But if we evacuate, then haven't we lost out? <sighs> you idiot, we'll just steal off the miners. Look, I saw with my own eyes. They managed to bag some Geomara. This is a perfect opportunity. Oh, good idea. Shameless. Still after the miners, are you? Time to teach you a lesson. Fight, fight, fight! No manners, huh? <laughs> Looks like I have the perfect elements against these guys. The first sign of danger. That's all they're good for. Huh? What's this? Did those guys leave it behind? Leave what behind? Oh. Whoa, whoa! What the heck? Exactly. Beep, beep! Searching for potential user. Beep, beep, beep. motherfucker! <laughs> Voice print detected! Looking up corresponding identity information. Oh my, it's an alien! Hey, it talks! And it knows that we aren't from this planet? It just seem to be technology from here. Look, it even has an International Peace Corporation logo on it. Perhaps it's an antiquity left behind by some past interstellar traveler. Hindi? Beep, beep, is, is that beep. the thing? Your mom's an antiquity! <laughs> Since you guys are beep, beep. all Hindi! So you aliens know about the International Peace Corporation? That's great! Beep, beep, beep. Oh, Finky, all right. The home use object Richard. Model information. Version 0 0.63. Professional model. It's not Finky, it's Richard. Nickname? Oh. Andy. Oh, nickname. Home use object finder? Who I'll just call it Richard until I forget that, I, that it's called Richard. Beep, <laughs> beep, beep. My brainwave scanner module is damaged. Please send me to an interastral peace appliances retail store near you for free repair within the warranty period of 232 years. That's a lot of years. Richard, so we can legally call him a dick. <laughs> Technically. Astral peace appliances retail store to conduct repairs. What? This spell is already broken. What should we do? Take it with us? Uh, don't mind the truth maxed out. Not yet, surprisingly not. Let's take it. Maybe it could be of some use. Yes, yes, yes. When you need to find something you can't see, just call upon Findy. That's me. All right, Richard. Whatever you say. Okay, am I allowed to now destroy this? I was supposed to destroy before. Was I seeing things? <laughs> Okay. Actually, yes, take a short Richard. I know, but still no. <laughs> no fighting in the chat, guys. Should probably target one of these. Give up. Wait, he's got this yeah. Tough luck running into me. Try hard sometimes. Watch this awesome move. According to the judgment of the Oratrice Mechanique Danalise Cardinal. Who invited you? We now turn to the Oratrice Mechanique Danalise Cardinal. They're getting judged. Just as my calculations predicted. No hidden chest around the corner or anything. What is that? Oh, it's a puzzle. Thing just called me an obstacle, didn't it? Rude! I'm judging with Nubi. What was that? 
Fargus detected. It's okay, I'll get rid of him. No manners, huh? Who will it be? Bells. Consequence. Uh give up. S.A.S. per kibbe. Knowledge, the measure of truth, and also I like how his attack is just like, okay, I'm gonna uh, make this building fall. Base holding puzzle as they are nothing. <laughs> but that was super easy though. Don't tell me you struggled with that. Then again, I'm really good at solving that Who sort of puzzles, like seeing patterns and stuff. <laughs> it was just like perfect match for me. Or a tree mechanique that is cut it all, indeed. Oh. Hey, Not I need it, but... Let me go near that thing to unlock. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. I'll deal with them later. Cool. I did not check if there was anything else important where I found that thing though. It was fine since I love puzzles like this, but I have seen many streamers struggle with these puzzles. Really? I mean, I know that some people play dumber, dumber than they actually are, so of course some of them could just be playing it up. But, yeah, I mean, I guess some people might struggle more with that sort of puzzles if they're not used to it. I knew I should check back here. I found this chest. I know how Hoyo works. <laughs> they like to hide chests. Oh. I should have maybe teleported instead of going all around the whole way, but yeah, it's fine. Cowards and bullies. I don't remember you guys acting this tough around Sparrow's minions. <laughs> Did your parents never teach you what a backbone was? <laughs> we ain't stupid. Why would we risk our lives against the robots? And get off the high road. You can't just find a huge chunk of Geomario and hog it all to yourselves. I mean, it's kind of the law here, so... Our territory. Yeah, you tell the them, day Antonia. Day in and day out. Don't even pretend like you're here to lend a hand. Exactly. You're lazy. All you want is to profit off our sweat and tears. You don't even try hiding it. Disgraceful. Yes, so disgraceful. Where does disgrace come into it when we can't even fill our stomachs, huh? I know your game. You're just waiting for us to starve to death so there's more food for your mining team. It's a waste of time trying to reason with you. While you've been kicking up this fuss, the whole vein's been seized by robots. Now we're all in the same foot. Don't worry, I'll take care of the robots. <laughs> right, right. We can't rely Probably. on the vein anymore. But don't forget which side brought loaded guns to the party. Well, we Is that a threat? <laughs> what are you trying to pull off? I'm warning you, wildfire in the area. <laughs> Empty threat. Wildfire are stuck dealing with Sparrow's minions. How are they gonna help you now? Unless you're planning on taking a bullet. Hand over the supplies and equipment. I don't think so. Getting ready to attack. Those miners are unarmed. You shameless scoundrels. Leave it to me. No need to play the hero. I'm going with you. Do we get a trial? I'm going to. We can't let these thugs get away with whatever they like. Aha! And who do we have here? Shut up! Do you know whose territory this is? Shut it. This isn't your territory. I'm in a hurry. I'll take you all in one go. Mm. Do we need to give a shield to someone yet? No manners, huh? Who will it be? 
Let's get rid of this guy. What was the percentages again? Oh, right. He throws chalk at people to kill them. I forgot about that. He battle over. Oh, Zila, thank goodness you came. We were nearly, uh... <laughs> Nothing but a few knuckleheads. I'm just glad you're okay. Antonia, have you seen Chief Oleg? Oleg? He took a group into the intersection. Said it was to clear off the invading robots. They've been gone for a while now. <laughs> if wildfire was around, those thugs wouldn't have dared. Seems like the core of this problem is Svarog's robots. Uh, we need to talk about this the boss. boss. He appeared suddenly after the guards were redeployed and became a major player in the underworld. Svarog claims to be a guardian of humanity. All the ownerless robots obey his commands. They've occupied the Furnace Core hub and they're not letting anyone get close. Nobody knows why Svarov did any of this. He usually doesn't leave the Furnace Core and interfere unless some kind of disorder breaks out in the underworld. Hmm. Wait. A guardian of humanity? That can command robots? I've never heard of anything like... Hmm. Looks like your mighty architects weren't as all-knowing as you thought. Can you two say anything without quarreling? This isn't the time! <sighs> Sounds like there's danger waiting for us in the intersection. Can we still get through? Mm. I want to meet Svarg and his minions. Right. There's unfinished business here. The chief is still down there. It's only a bunch of scrap metal. What are we afraid of? Exactly. Oh, is Zila starting to appreciate our strength? Hmm? I'll be honest. You guys are hardworking. If everyone from Wildfire were as impressive as you on the battlefield, we wouldn't be so hard-pressed by Svarog. Antonia, can you take the mining team back through the entrance to meet up with Natasha? <laughs> sure thing, but uh, be careful. There are a lot of robots up ahead. It's okay. I'll kill him. <laughs> 